right so it's july 1st which means halloween shopping <laughs> i don't have much hope that i'm gonna find anything but we're going anyway because i cannot resist myself okay i made it to joanne's but i realized that i'm not wearing mascara and i feel silly so like i'm honestly like about ready to wipe my makeup off so i have baby wipes so i'm gonna do that i don't know how this is gonna work considering i have contact in but I don't know, I did my makeup so that I would feel like better because I'm like terrified of going outside. And it didn't seem like it helped. In reality, it just kind of made it worse. So, I'm taking it off in the parking lot of Joanne's. I live in Rupa King Tell. Much better. And I'm going to put on this ColourPop Glowing Lip. The shade Kakatu. I've just been using this kind of as my lip balm because it's a very natural color for me. Now let's just hope that there's something Halloween in here and that I just didn't put makeup on to come here and get disappointed and leave. Probably will, but we'll see. There's pumpkins. $50 for this candle holder, but it looks really good. Oh, I like this shelf, too. And this. I love this. It's $40, so I'm kind of not happy about that. I like this. What is this? $15. I think this is cute. A Wicked Witch and a Grumpy Toad live here. $25 so I love this they're 40% off but they got towels of it so like you say witch like it's a bad thing big witch energy the moon phases some mugs too I don't really need mugs, but kind of an odd choice for a skeleton, but okay. Ooh, those are cool. Like lanterns, like skeleton lanterns. And then we have um, flamingo, bone flamingos that are like iridescent to that side. I think they do get lights too, but I don't have a plug to go outside, so it has to be um, battery operated or solar lights. And it doesn't say. I'm just gonna use the plug. I like these. This is cute. What is this? Haunted bed and breakfast. Or dead and breakfast. Please book ahead and save for a spell. This is cute. I kind of like this for the kitchen. And that's probably not meant for the kitchen, but that's what I want to use it for. Should I hang little skeletons from my balcony? This is cute too. That's a snake. There's 4th of July fireworks going off right now and I'm in the freaking Halloween section. So I got a few things I have to show you when I get home. Only a couple. But I only spent 40 bucks, which honestly, for what I got, mm, I would rather it be cheaper, but I need to get some serotonin. So I got it and I was kind of like, what if I don't buy it though? I'm going to be constantly thinking about it and what if I can't find it later? So I just bought it because I really like this stuff. But I need to find nails because there's a few things that I need to hang up. And they have that like razor edge like backing sort of thing and then i need to get nails because i can't use some packs for that so off to high nails all right i'm heading closer to home to see if there's nails there but i did also want to mention that the girl at joanne's was actually really nice at the front um and was talking to me about how she loves the celestial stuff and she's coming her daughter and like all the stuff so i got to have like a little chat with somebody who's also buying halloween stuff right now so I figured I'd show you the few things that I got. Um, one of them was this sign. It says, a wicked witch and a grumpy old toad live here. I thought it was really cute. I also got this hand that I showed. As this skull that I showed as well. Um, at least with these two items, I'm kind of thinking about getting like a shelf or something so I can like, well, it's not gonna stand up down here but 
you know, do that and put something in the middle. Maybe I can't really light candles because um, of her, but maybe like a fake candle in the middle and like things like that. I think that might be fun.